Hello, my name is Kent Philpott. I am making this video on December the 6th, 2016. For many years now, I have been researching and writing about Islam. One of the things I continually come across in the literature, particularly the Quran, uh, are the discussion about hellfire and the jinn. Now, the jinn is what we would call demons. And it is all through the literature, and it is a big part of the life of the average Muslim, at least those Muslims who take their religion seriously. Now, as I think about this, I decided to make this video, short video, and make uh, a few suggestions and give a couple of ideas. It seems to me that all of the material about hellfire and the jinn and all the protections needed kind of looked to me like scare tactic. Uh, it's something that highly motivates many, particularly young Muslims. Uh, they're concerned about going and experiencing hellfire. And they realize that unless they are very solid and disciplined Muslims, they perhaps are in danger of being troubled by the jinn. And so I look at that and I think how much of a contrast that is with the Christian scripture, the Bible. Now, in the Bible, we do have information about hell. And yes, in fact, that there are demons. But the contrast between Islam and Christianity on this point could not be greater. The Bible takes very seriously the reality of hell. The reason is that God is utterly sinless and holy, and we are not. But he has provided for that because when Jesus was placed on the cross, when he died in our place, that substitutionary atonement, Jesus literally took our sin upon himself. One of the important verses in the Christian Bible is 1 John 3, 8. The reason the Son of God appeared was to destroy uh, the works of the devil. And Jesus routinely cast out demons. And Christians have done the same from the first century to this day, of which I am ample witness to and have engaged in this for decades, and I have seen literally hundreds of demons driven out of hundreds of people. Christians need not live in fear of either hellfire or demons. That is just not the case. We have nothing to fear because Christians are safe in Jesus Christ. And the reason I'm making this video because I put myself in the place of Muslim people who for centuries have lived in fear of both hellfire and demons. One is never sure. One cannot be so scrupulous to avoid uh, being attacked by the jinn. And so we do understand the good news that we have in our Lord Jesus Christ who has delivered us from the power of the awful demons and has made us citizens of heaven. And so I do this because I love Muslim people and desire to reach out to them and to bring them this very good news. So long.